I realise this is upsetting. No, this is terrifying. I've got strangers camped out on my doorstep taking snapshots of my family. Carol, it's really important you don't let these people get to you. That's just what they want. You keep telling us this, but it doesn't help. These sort of crooks only ever make threats. All our information on this scam tells us they wouldn't have the guts to actually carry any of them out. Yeah, well, if Billy doesn't testify, we don't have to rely on your information, do we? Mrs Jackson, please listen. Look, we can protect you and the family until the trial's over. <laughs> what, with panic buttons on mobile phones? These people carry guns. Carol, they're not going to do anything stupid. It would destroy their colleagues' chances. I want out. So, we just let them walk away. Because that's what'll happen. This is my eight-year-old son. I don't care what happens to them. I want Biddy left alone and my family's life back to normal. I understand. If I was you, I'd feel exactly the same. But we can't change the fact that Billy was involved. It's impossible to turn the clock back. Billy, get upstairs and get your bag sorted for school. Oh, I'm sorry, sweetheart. I didn't mean to shout. We've got a few things to discuss with the police, and then me and your dad are going to walk you to school today. We thought you'd treat you two at a bacon sarnie on the way. Yeah? Go on, then. I should never let you lot get us involved. Now, if you want those thugs put away, sort it out yourself and leave my family out of it. It's not as simple as that, I'm afraid. Of course it is. You can't make us bring Billy to the trial. We can't, but a judge could. I'm afraid he's right. A judge could subpoena you. What's that mean? It means he could order you to attend. And if we didn't? Then you might face prosecution yourselves. I don't believe you. You're supposed to be protecting us! We are. That's the point. Billy testifying is the surest way your family will be safe. Once Billy's told the court what he saw, then it's over. If you stop him testifying tomorrow, a conviction will be extremely unlikely. These people will be out and then we can't protect anyone. I don't believe you people. As I said, Carol, we're only doing what we know to be best for all concerned. Better get out of here. Are we walking bullets? Yeah, no, get there. Considering what's going on, I don't think it matters if it's a bit late, do you? 